Oh, oh my god, it's so god tier! They're close! Look at this shit! It's like something about the running animations, man. What's going on, you guys? It's your boy S Review, aka Random Black Gamer, aka RBG, aka Shadow Moses, aka Suntan Superman. Here with my girl Johnny Lee on the ones and two, and we ain't seen a reactions. I hope you guys are having a blessed day because we sure are, and we are feeling great. Because today we're gonna be reacting to a new anime that has been recommended to us by not just you guys, but a lot of friends and family members, and that is. Jujutsu Kaisen. This has been an anime that's been making waves lately, man, and I have been really excited to get into this because I had my homeboy, my, my my homie that's gonna be my best man at my wedding, Cody. Shout out to you, man. You might know him as Murtistic. Check out his YouTube channel. He's been recommending me to watch this show, telling me a lot of things about it, a lot of stuff that I just forgot about because everybody just be telling me stuff. You know how when something just be just buzzing in the anime world and you be like man I don't feel like getting into this because it's just got so much hype you feel like that sometimes when stuff is just getting overhyped yeah maybe not anime but just yeah anything anything yeah. you know yeah. it's just you know some sometimes you just want to get to something when you get to it and that's just the way I am you know I kind of shy away from stuff that's just getting a lot of buzz you know and every time I would hear the name of Jujutsu Kaisen like people would kind of mess it up like my uncle he was like you need to watch this show it's uh Jujutsu uh Jujutsu Kokumi and I was like are you talking about Jujutsu Kaisen which is a name that's like a tongue twister but, you know, it always puts me in the mind of something like Naruto or Ninja Scroll or some of those other bangers that have jujitsu and stuff like that up in them. So I am just super hyped to watch this, man, because we're trying to expand the brand and we're trying to make sure that you guys are pleased with everything that we have to watch. And today we're going to be checking out episode one of this in English dub because we know you guys hate that. But hey, this is a chance for you guys to watch it in English this time around, especially if it's an older episode, man. We know how it is. We try to please everybody. Shout out to the uh, fans over in Thailand, the people in Russia that comment. We love you guys, and we hope you guys enjoy this episode. So without further ado, Johnny, what do you say we get into this? Let's jump on it. Let's jump on it. He's either a Zeroichi or Organization 13 member. What the hell is this? That looks like a weird sex dungeon. Right. He's a scumbag. We have to watch this intro. Yes, I know. You gotta get a vibe for this, man. That look like the streets of Dallas. <laughs> for real. <laughs> All the different ways you can get to a place. Yeah. I say I like the animation of the... It has CG background in this intro. Ooh, the lighting looks good. Yeah. We got pandas with expressions. We got billionaire dudes. Weird salamander looking animals. Yeah. This guy looks like he's either going to be a top tier protagonist or he's going to be a guy that's trying to mentor the main character. He's just acting as a bad guy. Oh my god, he has some good animation though. Like the Sakuga, really Sakuga animation. The weird character that likes blood. Mm hmm. Uh oh! Panda? Man, they got brothers in this too? Yeah, the way that the light is bouncing off of different things is really good. First rule of Fight Club. <laughs> 
Never talk about Fight Club. Hear it. They probably got some top killers up in this series. He look like he a top killer. They're keeping a cursed object here in a place like this. Could they be any more stupid? <laughs> Did he really think it was going to be in there? I'm <laughs> talking to my brother on the phone. Yeah. I'm seriously going to punch him. <laughs> Please. <laughs> what do you say? Sasaki? Ikuchi? Okay. Go! Spirit gods, spirit gods! Which creature is the council president barely weaker than? Is this like a Japanese Ouija board? Or that pencil game. Mm -hmm. So what if it was ticks? The occult club is trying to uncover occult activity, so it's still a valid activity report. This is not some kind of kids game. Besides, the biggest problem is you, Yuji Itadori. He does remind me of Ida. He's all about what's right. Mm -hmm. Boy, boy, boy. You did that? But I, I'm sure I wrote a cult club. I'm the one who changed it. Coach Takagi? What for? Because track and frack and field team needs you on it. So says the only teacher more problematic than the students. How many times do I have to tell you I'm not joining the team? You are. No, I'm not. However, I'm, I'm not some demon. So if you can defeat me, I'll excuse you from the team. And we'll settle this fair and square by competing. Is there a dead body buried here or something? So there's some super, supernatural shit going on with some of these areas. Spirit this high level here. That looks like a great tomb. And only the gifted can see these beers. Damn. Its presence is too strong to pin down. Feels like it's close by, but it could actually be far away. This special grade cursed object's a serious pain. Who could have moved it? And where is it now? Show him up, brother. See what you got. It's just a rumor, but I heard that he beat all the stages of Ninja Warrior and that he's the reincarnation of Mirko Krukop. Oh, wow. wow. <laughs> hey, so can I throw it however I want? Mm hmm. For this challenge, you can throw however you want. After all, I know this event isn't your strong suit. You probably never even really. Read. Oh, it showed you, bro. Uh. Yes. <laughs> yes, I crushed it. Kind of more gorilla. Wait, he said if you. Visible. Oh, if you defeat me, you don't have to get on the team. Yeah. Ah, oh, look at his face. <laughs> force yourself to stay in our occult club. Huh? Really? But even though you love scary stuff, without me, you could never go to haunted places. From bullshit, bro. Scared. School rules are I have to be. <laughs> I could never. He's just so dumb, right now. Ghost member. After all, we're the occult club. <laughs> yeah, I did say that. Besides, I want to be able to go home by six. <laughs> <laughs> Got this fucking elf from oh, Death Note looking ass, dude. Cursed energy. I wonder if he's like Zenon. <laughs> oh, I just thought about Whoa, that terrible wig, like RCD, RDC, whoever the hell, Davey having on yeah. when they play him. <laughs> ah. The presence of a cursed object. So he has something hey, within oh. him. How is she that fast? Some form of a demon yeah, spirit or some shit. Three seconds. Mm. That's why he's able to throw shit so hard. Now listen to me, since I've got free time too. Not interested. Listen anyway, I've got some things I want to say before I reach the end. About your parents, I don't want you to Come on, I told you, I'm not interested. Grandpa, please, can you stop trying to act all- Your daddy was a demon and your mom was a host. Yeah, that's something, I was like, either your mom got infected with demon semen or your dad was just a half demon himself. You don't have to- Why can't the mom be the half demon? I don't know. Mom might be a freaking. She might be a demon or something, or some kind of spirit apparition. But I don't know. She's that spider lady from uh, Wicked, Wicked City. City. <laughs> Yuji. Huh? 
You're a strong kid, so try to help others. Save the people you can, even if it's only those closest to you. It's okay if you lose your way, and don't worry about whether they'll thank you or not. Just save as many as you can, even if you can only save one. When you die, you should be surrounded by people. Don't end up like me. Awkward. That was a beautiful moment. Did he die? Is he dead? Grandpa? Yes? What can I do for you? Oh, I hate to go out on a it's sad really speech hard. like that. Hello? Are you there? He should have probably let him tell him whatever he was going to say. It's dead. Damn. That is some poop. It is. That sucks. Bruh, why and it's like he's just been neglecting to hear all the words of encouragement from right? his grandpa. Are you sure you're going to be okay? Man, that shit was kind of sad. I'm a little bit sad by that. I am too. So it doesn't feel real yet. So at first, I thought he was going to say my grandpa needs his diaper changed or something. Like this. And it was going to be like funny. Yeah. Be respectful. Yuji Tadori. I don't know what it just reminds me of goddamn Professor Xavier. Like soon as he was finally happy, his ass ended up dead. Morning, right now. I understand, but this can't wait. The cursed object you possess is very dangerous. I need you to hand it over. Cursed object? This. Oh, yeah, that. Yeah, I found that. I didn't think much of it, but my friends were totally into it. What's dangerous about it? Every year, there are more than 10,000 unexplained deaths and missing persons in Japan. Hold it! Where is it? Knock it off! You see, my friends were planning to, uh... To do what? Well, they were saying, let's open it up to see what's inside it tonight. Wow. Why? Is that bad? Is that bad? <laughs> gonna open up a world of trouble, worse. literally. For real. Your friends are, dead. are going to die. I'll handle this. Oh, no way! I'm coming! I may not know those two that well, but... But they're friends! I have to help! You're staying here. You might want to let bad hair down here with this shit. Hmm. <laughs> Fat boy die? Probably. What time is it? What time is it? What is that thing? Dinner time! <laughs> Oh, no. Where have you He's a demon. Uh oh. Oh wow. Yes. Out of my way. Ooh. Oh man, you see that hand just I've seen it. Uh oh. Let's go, Guru man. Eat it, boy. I'm surprised you didn't say your favorite. Whip. I'm not even gonna say it, because if you didn't think of it, I don't wanna give you the idea. Okay. Your friends are going to die. Inuyasha. Inuyasha's daddy. That's your favorite thing to say. No, I was gonna say Shishomaru. Was I afraid of it before? Didn't feel Inuyasha's like brother. Oh, oh my god, it's so god tier! They're close! Look at this shit! It's like something about the running animations, man. It looks good. It looks fluid. Look at the thick lines. Oh, y'all go. Oh, my goodness. The, the titty fondling. It's raping the Kobe. It's crabby, short tempered, and stubborn. No one but me ever even visited him. Don't end up like me, huh? Well, no chance of that. Damn. What you gonna do, homie? I am the first object. Uh, I'm not gonna make it. This is pretty intense. I it like is. that this started pretty quick, it didn't waste much time. Yeah! Kick in the goddamn window. Dynamic man. entry! I think you had a proper death, Grandpa. <laughs> yeah. But this kind of a death is just wrong! Man. Oh, he got him out too. Not what I was expecting. Tight. I should be asking what you're doing here. Oh, no, just playing with it. <laughs> you're pretty smug, aren't you? 
So, just curious. What are those things munching on the curse? Spirit wolves. Wait, you can see them? Shimagami's nice. Curse can't be seen. So they're kind of like personas. Or stands. Yeah, that makes sense. That I've dog is going to town. Like he is. Huh. The cursed object. Ryoman Sukuna's finger. It's a miracle that thing didn't swallow it. Why would anything eat this? Is it good? Don't be dense. You'd eat it to gain stronger cursed energy. Now, hand it over. It's dangerous. I think I heard something about this. My uncle told me about it. Run! Bad hair day better not have gotten killed. Just you better leave him alone. I don't think they're gonna kill a bad hair day. If you Ooh. If y'all kill my dude. Oh, oh that sucks. Bro, you gotta do something. You can turn into ass chili right now. Like come on man. That's a new one. That's all I had to think of. He can't even make his gang signs anymore. Ooh. Do it. Try to help others. I'm living with a rotten curse of my own already. Hit boy. Let's go. That's gotta be nasty. A several who knows how old year old finger. This is it good? Don't be dense. You need it to gain stronger cursed energy. There's a way I can save everyone. I just need to have my own. I need to swallow this form of CG. Don't do it. Don't do it. Ryuman Sukuna's finger. That's a special great cursed object. It's a deadly poison. He'll die for sure. But there is a chance. He's strong enough to handle it. Hmm. Beat that demon's ass, cause he ain't shit. <laughs> Oh, bitch slap! Did you just see the bitch slap into uppercut? Come on, bro. Oh, we got claws now. Mm -mm. Shit. Manicure on point? Iron Reaver soul stealer his ass, bro. Maybe he got the curse marks too. On oh, some fucking Shimagami Nocturnal. <laughs> Sugui! <laughs> I'm gonna have to get my nails like that. Oh shit. A one in a million chance worst case scenario. The special grade cursed object has incarnated. Cursed flesh is so boring. So now, where are the people? The women? Oh shit, he's gonna go crazy. Oh, damn it. We were rooting for you. Go and show off those Masako marks. It'll be a massacre! <laughs> I was thinking, like, what if his what inner self could bite it? Right. Hey, wait. How are you doing that? Well, it's my body. Wait. He's suppressing me? Stay right where you are. You're no longer human. Huh? Yuji Tadori. Tadori. By law, I will now exercise you as a curse. Man. Why y'all ain't tell me that was a good anime, man? Y'all love just one. keeping stuff away from me and right? not keeping me in on all the good shit. It's like everybody was just kind of bypassing this one and they didn't want to mention it. They didn't even want yeah, to say I've the name Yeah, I've seen a correctly. lot of comments of a lot of different things, but I haven't seen that one. It's like, this shit is fire, man, and I expect nothing less from MAPPA. It just sucks that you guys didn't mention this in the comments. But no, man, I appreciate you guys. I really, really appreciate you guys for mentioning this because this is the right amount of shonen, you know, that we enjoy mixed in with a lot of darkness yeah, elements and stuff. Yeah, but it's not too It's not too, too much on the kitty yeah, side. It, Just the perfect balance. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I was surprised by it. I feel like I could get more into it, but this was a great start. Like, usually for me, if the first episode or so doesn't grab me, I'm just kind of like, eh. But I'm, yeah, this first episode yeah. really did it. You know, it didn't yeah, hold, man. it didn't hold back at all. 
Yeah, yeah. It's like this show put a smile on my crusty lips because I am just ready to just binge this. But I know we have to take our time. Right, man. that's the only Too thing. much demonic energy might just corrupt us, and we have to make sure that we get our healthy yeah. dose of it from time to time. You know what I'm saying? Like, I am, like, really enthralled with this world. One thing, I say a few things that it reminds me of. You obviously have the high school kind of trope, mm-hmm. which is the perfect setting to cause a lot of chaos because you have these small, tight hallways that these characters always get into fights to, and they take it to the rooftops most of the time. Yeah, it's, and it's unfortunately, it's like you have the best vulnerable targets. Teenagers don't know if they're coming or going. Yeah. Ripping and running to and from class and with their friends trying to, you know, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and then I also like, which I'm figuring this out, that that demon probably has body parts spread all over the world from what I, you know, from what I'm assuming because a finger just seems like, oh, yeah, I'm mm-hmm. like, there's got to be more to this demon than just yeah. a finger lift. It and just that, probably was a finger That there. might be the head honcho of the demons, you know, out of all of them. And he's been utilized to just keep all these spirits away. So that's an interesting concept. You know, I think that's something that's going to bring a lot to this. A lot of imagination and world building to this. Uh, as far as the main character Itadori is concerned, I like his personality, but I do wish he could take things more seriously. That's just another one of those common tropes that we get from the main protagonists of these series where they're just the goofball dickhead. I kind of like that, though. I like that he's not so serious. He's like, I like that. Yeah, but man, we are already at the 29 minute mark and we're about to... The camera's going to cut off on us and I just have so much to say, but I just appreciate you guys for actually just giving me that extra push because as I said earlier, I've already been getting recommended to show by my uncle and a few of my friends. So it's just good to have that reconfirmation that this show is a good show. It has all the elements that we like and we can't wait to react to the next episode, which is episode two. For the rating, I'm going to give this a solid A+. For this first episode. I have to give it an A+. Yeah. But without further ado, guys, let's go ahead and jump into the episode two, shall we? Yuji Tadori. By law, I will now exercise... Skirt, skirt, skirt! The curse! No, really, I'm feeling fine. Besides, you and I are both pretty beat up. Shouldn't we see a doctor? I can't tell if this is Itadori speaking or the cursed object. Damn it. What do I do now? What's the situation? Huh? Satoru Gojo? What are you doing here? Hey. I wasn't planning on showing up. But you got kind of roughed up, kid. I'll show the second years. Say cheese! <laughs> <laughs> I got an earful from the higher-ups because the special grade cursed object's still missing. So they're from the same organization. So, did you find We got the again? same kind of jacket on. Uh... Hmm? Sorry, but... I ate that thing. <laughs> really? I you did. did. Okay, give us ten seconds. Hmm, flex. Right back into your Stretch throat. it. Yeah, but... Yeah, it's you about to fight? I'm way too strong for him. Megumi, hold on to this for me. Uh-oh. So what is this? Kikufuku from Kikusuya. It's Sendai specialty and it's super good. I recommend the Zunda and cream flavor. This guy actually went and bought souvenirs while he's not the guy. Isn't the guy he said he was gonna punch? This on the bullet train ride. It's like he senses that he's about to get his ass whooped. Kufuku's just the best. Mm. <laughs> Swag on cream inside that really makes the difference. Hmm. Oh, you almost had him. You had to be quicker than that. You <laughs> right. No. Oh. Oh, you see that spin? Mm-hmm. Yo. Mmm. For crying out loud, you jujutsu sorcerers are always such a pain in the ass in any era. Okay, so that's what they call jujutsu sorcerers. Sorcerers. like. Time doesn't really have much meaning for me. <laughs> mm. Seven, eight, oh, nine, and that should do it. This stuff is still floating around them, so they must be moving super fast. Again, why can't I seem to take over this body? Who the hell is this? 
Either this guy has a strong will or that thing just has a certain amount of time which you can just cut loose. Uh, how about that? So you really can control that guy. Go to sleep, buddy. You're out of there. What'd you do to him? I just knocked him out. But the end result is still your execution. Oh, so that's how we got here. I figured that was what it was. <laughs> hey, sorry. I did my best. You still have to die, but I got your sentence suspended. What's suspended mean? You'll wait until later to kill me? Yep. I'll just explain from the top. This is the same kind of thing as the cursed object you ate. There are 20 of these in total. We possess six of them. When you die, the curse inside you will die as well. You see, our elders are cowards. They're demanding we kill you right away. But that would be a waste, wouldn't you say? A waste? See, there's no assurance another vessel capable of handling Sukuna will ever be born again. So, here's what I propose to them. Since they've already decided to execute you, why not wait until after you've absorbed all of Sukuna to do it? And the higher-ups agreed, so now you have two options before you. You can die here and now, or gather all the parts of Sukuna, absorb them, and then die. So, have you decided what you want to do? Are casualties like these from curses pretty common? Well, this one was a rather exceptional case, but in terms of damage, it happens all the time. It's a good night when someone dies a normal death after encountering a curse. Finding a body that's torn to pieces is actually one of the better outcomes. Really? One of the better ones? Hmm. Shit. If you plan to hunt down Sukuna, you're going to witness some gruesome stuff. And I can't guarantee you won't end up that way yourself. So, I guess you can choose which hell you want. That's gotta be messed up. So have you got that finger? You'll eat that too? Looking at it again here in broad daylight, it's pretty disgusting. Oh. He spawns the shit whole. One tenth of the whole. That shit has to be fucked up because you're dealing with somebody with, like something with a strong fingernail. Mm -hmm. The more he consumes that shit, the more it's gonna take over or give you more control. <laughs> so gross. I mean, so gross. It's funny. I'll eat every part of Sukuna. After that, I don't care. As far as how I'm gonna die, I've already decided. My guy! I love finding guys like you! Really? A fun time in hell awaits. So they're basically sending this guy on a suicide Are mission. Basically. Eat every one of the demon's parts, be that vessel, and die. Anyway, here's the deal. You're going to the school for Jujutsu sorcerers that I attend. Huh? Tokyo Metropolitan Jujutsu Technical High School. It's one of only two Jujutsu educational facilities. As a sort of cover, it's known as a private religious school. Many mm. Jujutsu sorcerers continue to use it. And it's only how many people? Three? So it's a pillar. Three of the first year. Not oh. just an education. So I'm ready to see some more badasses, like some more people that have mm, skills. Yeah. You're about to have an interview with the I principal. figured after that principal. banger of an opening the episode, they probably have to calm it down like a little bit. Mm -hmm. huh? And what happens then? Immediate execution? What's this? So you're not the boss? Any hierarchy other than strength is worthless! I'm sorry about that. Sometimes he just does that. What an amusing body you have now. I do owe yeah. you a big Again. favor. If that ain't Migi, I don't know who it is. Yeah. <laughs> I kill. It's my honor to be targeted by Sukuna himself. This guy is really that famous? Ryomen Sukuna is an imaginary fierce god with four arms and two faces. But he once existed as an actual human being, although it was over a thousand years ago. Well, if Sukuna regained all his power, he might cause me... Oh, he would fold the shit out of him if he had all his powers. 
I would win. I wonder what his blindfold is for, though. Like, what is that? I mean, he sure he'd win, though, Fred. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think so. You're late, yeah. Sotaro. <laughs> Eight minutes late. Yeah. As usual, not quite enough to chastise you for. I told you, fix that habit. That old dude's making cute things? If it's not enough to chastise me, those are always the tough ones that make the cute shit. Besides, you're just sitting right. around making dolls. I don't know if you remember Kanji from Persona 4. You're saying you'll fight curses just because someone else told you to do that? Insufficient. <laughs> Insignificant fool. Oh. Mm -hmm. That's not a doll. They're made from spirit thread. In a way, they're corpses. Dolls that I've infused with my curse. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this shit is too plush. He's gonna give him his issue. Of a doll. <laughs> the person's true nature reveals itself during a crisis. I'll keep attacking you until I get an acceptable answer. <sighs> Look, man, it wasn't just someone else. Not the stuffing out of it. Dying request. Go. Beat his old plushy <laughs> ass up. Uh oh. Where is it? Boom. Hey, do something, man. Someone else. He looks like a man. Oh, God. <laughs> all right. It's a doll, so it doesn't get, get this funky yeah. looking wall. <laughs> Constantly faces death. I was about to say he looks like a damn jelly bean, but then he decided to show us his butthole. Right. Flash from those who that's murdered. Murdered. It's an un. But well, he's showing out. <laughs> you have to be highly motivated and perhaps a little crazy to handle it. Damn old man, you say some pretty harsh things. Teaching is making people realize truths. That's right. I guess. Hmm. Sorry, you kid. He wasn't ready. That was a shin sure you can. It's not easy to imagine how you'll feel. Can you imagine getting your ass whooped by something like that? However, I that would probably I panic. <laughs> I would be so mad. I'd be so mad, bro. Dying wish. Jujutsu sword. I'd be too panicked out to be mad. Like, I'm getting my ass beat by a plush jelly bean with a, a face. A bootleg Digimon and a horrible wig. As a kid, I was always better than most in sports and in fights. But never once did I. He had to tell his life stories, get his ass whooped so bad. Never. <laughs> oh. Consuming Sukuna is something only I can do. That's it, man. I give. If I could escape my death sentence and run away from this responsibility, then someday I'd be eating food, taking a bath, or reading manga. In the moment I stopped to think, I'd go. Oh, I bet that right now, somewhere out there, someone is dying because of Sukuna. But that doesn't concern me. It's certainly not my fault. You expect me to tell myself that? Well, I refuse to do that. Let's pop the stuffing out of that thing. But I won't regret the way I lived. Satoru, show him to his dorm room. Be sure to explain the security arrangements to him as well. Huh? Your admit. Welcome to Jujutsu to Jujutsu Tech. Is the thing just turned into like a defenseless? Oh shit! Uh, sorry. <laughs> oh, I, I want to see more of that thing. This place is huge. All the second and third years. I love that. But you'll meet them all soon enough. There aren't many of them. You know, there's no real reason for you to go fight at all. Mm. The first yes. thing he gonna put on you gotta, the you Gotta put up the Hitomi Tanakers, man. You yeah. gotta put up my nice try, guy. I said I'd do it, and I will. Hey, dude. So I gotta say, hanging out until Fushiguro comes back all beat up just to bring me a finger? <laughs> That'd be funny. <laughs> yeah, but you wouldn't have refused to fight. I already knew that. Huh? That was a test? See, I knew this guy was going to be cool. He was just testing him. To find. Don't you think we'd have collected them all already? Some have a presence that's overwhelming. Some keep very quiet. And some have already been absorbed by a cursed spirit. These are the challenges we've dealt with. 
when it comes to searching for them. But at last we have you. The Sukuna within you will try to regain his power, and that will lead us to the fingers. You're both vessel and locator. Our mm. very own radar. That's cool. So you see, we won't get it just sucks that he has to be a sacrificial lamb, though. Are you sure right? He's like, why? Why do I have to put oh, myself through all this shit? There. You're next door. Hey, Fushiguro! Wow, you look all better now. There's lots of other empty rooms, you know? Sure, but isn't it better to have some company? I thought it'd be good. Glasses and the missions are enough. This is not welcome. Whoa, it's so organized in here. Back off. I just told you, you're not welcome. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, close me in the room since I'm not welcome. Heading out tomorrow. We're gonna go pick up the third and final first year. Okay, let's go. Who is it? The train bound for Tokyo is now. I wonder if it's a girl. Please stand behind the yellow line. Ain't no telling. I think it is. It has to be. Four hours and I'm still only in Morioka. But at least I can finally kiss that damn countryside goodbye. And I'll be in Tokyo by this afternoon? What should I do if I get scouted? Like by Stardust. All right, guys, that was episode two, Jujutsu Kaisen, man. We are getting into the deep depths of hell with this because it's going to be a lot of hell that ensues for my boy Itadori or Itadori. I'm still trying to get familiar with the names. You know, this is kind of difficult trying to memorize all these Japanese names. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We got Fushigoro or Fush Fushigoro and um, what's my other guy's name? Go, whatever his name is. Goju. Goju. Yeah, Goju. So, yeah. you know, it's going to be interesting seeing how these characters are doing. They're in the Jutsu uh, Academy or Tech School now. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we're going to see Itadori learn more techniques and how to deal with these different kind of like demons and stuff like that. That's going to be interesting. The only thing that I'm just so bummed out about is that Itadori basically has to be a sacrificial lamb to actually rid the world of this demon that was once one of the top tier big mm -hmm. booty daddies, you know what I'm saying? Like, he was the big booty daddy. He was just running amok, causing all kind of chaos in the form of a human vessel that just got corrupted. So that, you know, that's kind of a bummer, but I'm interested to see how it's gonna turn out, because we already know that uh, the main character, he's gonna have to become like one or become partners with this demon in a sense, you know, they're gonna have to work mm -hmm. together. This demon seems to have a sense of humor. Yeah, he has a sense of humor. He knows a lot of things. He's been in the world for t uh, for thousands of years, so I'm pretty sure it's gonna take uh, whatever my guy's name is, Itadori. <laughs> I gotta look over the name just to figure it out, but yeah, Itadori to, you know, make him change his ways and potentially, you know, sacrifice himself without killing Itadori. You know, he just rid the world of himself. But uh, yeah, man, overall, I am just enjoying this series, man, because the, the animation just seems to be well balanced compared to other things that we've seen from MAPPA. Mm -hmm. you know? Yeah, it, it's, it is pretty well balanced. I like it. It's simple. It's not too dramatic, yeah. but what it is, what it does do is well done. So it I can does. appreciate that. Yeah, it's yeah. like when it intensifies, it really, really intensifies. Mm -hmm. Like it's just punch to the nuts animation. And like I really, really enjoy it. It's like they have a good balance of their main key animators and the ones that just go all out with all the crazy shit. So I am really enjoying that and I'm gonna enjoy seeing where these characters go next because we have another episode where they're gonna meet this other schoolmate, which mm -hmm. is basically a girl that's that she predicted. And yeah, I, I figured I was like that it won't be three boys. It just can't. Yeah, man, but this is great. I'm gonna give this one I'll give this one a high B. Yeah, no, high no, B. I'll give it a low A. I'll give it a low A because it did start off with some top tier animation in the form of that fight at the beginning. I'll probably give it a, a high B. Um, Cause yeah, that, that part at the beginning was pretty cool, but the rest of it was slow, but it kind of needed to be slow. Yeah, we needed downtime to get more fleshed out and get these characters more yeah, fleshed out. Yeah, to figure out exactly what's going on. I think this seems like, I don't know, I could be wrong, but this seems like an anime that's going to have a lot of uptime anyway. It yeah. kind of has to. Yeah, it's like, if anything, I, f I feel like there's going to be a lot of encounters with different characters and they're going to show the showcase their skills and stuff. Mm -hmm. And we're going to see the animation just ramp up at any time. I like, I like what animation... Top tier animation is very sporadic throughout episodes. I don't like when 
oh, the animation gets very good at the end of the episode and stuff of that nature, or we have to wait to a certain period of time. That's not what you want from MAPPA. They're in the same league as Madhouse and all these other ones, like Bones. So I expect nothing less from them. And they've been bringing it, you know. So hopefully that that remains consistent with this show mm -hmm. because the tone is just well balanced. I really mm -hmm. enjoy this. Yeah, but yeah, a low A for me, and you say a high B. Mm -hmm. Yep. But guys, let us know what you think in the comments below. Do you want us to continue reacting to this series because it's good? It's really good. We appreciate you guys for actually recommending it for us. In a way, I kind of want them to say no so we can just binge it. So we can binge <laughs> Right, because we are kind of dedicated to reacting to this for you guys because, you know, you are basically the ones that actually give us the views and stuff like that. So Right. If they say no, then it's like, yes, we can binge this. Exactly. But we do love sharing our terms. Yeah. Them. Yeah. Like, we really do enjoy sharing our reaction and our overall experience with these new things that we watch, man. This is why we ain't seen it. And thankfully, we are just now catching on to this anime so we can actually have something to talk about. Then we can say we done seen it. Exactly. But let us know what you think in the comments below, guys. As always, we ask you like or dislike the video. And you know, it doesn't matter if it's a thumbs up. It can also be a thumbs down. You know, maybe you can just critique us, critique us on the things that you think we shouldn't do in the next reaction. But also... By the time this video is uploaded, we should have episodes three and four already uploaded on Patreon. So make sure you subscribe if you want to get early access to those episodes. We also have a poll in which we are doing right now for the most voted for reactions or for uh, most voted for openings for reaction, you yeah. know, anime openings. So you can subscribe to that for only a dollar a month. So, yeah, guys, this is RBG, a.k.a. S Review. And my girl Johnny Lee. And this is We Ain't Seen It. And we will catch you guys in the next episodes of Jujutsu Kaisen. Peace out.